number one resolution. And the question is, have you stuck to it? And if not, I think we have a very interesting way for you to get back on the wagon and get in shape with the Tough Mudder. That's right. right? Hey. Okay, and so Eric, tell our viewers, what, what is the Tough Mudder? Well, you led into it perfectly, and that is really all about challenge. I mean, Tough Mudder is really much more than just a race. It's about a challenge. It's about setting those goals and accomplishing it. And what better way to, like, or what better uh, goal than to, like, get out, run 10 miles with your best friends? Okay, but, but there's, there's a fun element to this, though, too. Absolutely. You're not just getting out and pounding the pavement. The Tough Mudder is a really unique race in itself, and I think that's why so many people return to it year after year after year, right? Absolutely. We have such an amazing community, and it spans across all of our different products. I mean, if 10 miles is not for you, we have a great community of, like, Tough Mudder 5K folks, mm -hmm. Tough Mudder half folks. It means five miles is totally doable. We even have a new competitive series called Tough Mudder X. I mean, it's really can't be beat. Okay, and it's, see, okay, but here's the fun part. Yeah, right here. It's called Tough Mudder because there's mud. <laughs> In yeah. it. So, I mean, everybody loves, I mean, let's face it, children love to play in the mud. Adults love to play in the mud. Not as socially accepted <laughs> as when adults get to play in mud. But here it is socially acceptable for you to go out, uh, get dirty, go through these obstacle courses, which also I think is a really great fun aspect to being fit and challenging yourself. Because not only are you going out and you're doing the cardio workout, but uh, you're challenging yourself by climbing things and diving into things. You're getting a lot of upper body, lower mm -hmm. body in that as well. Exactly. Yeah, I mean, right here you're seeing just just the the wide array of challenges that you can mm -hmm. that you can have on the course. And yes, it's absolutely socially acceptable acceptable <laughs> to get out and get muddy on our Tough Mudder course. And we do that really uh, better than any anybody else. So I'm excited to to see what Sacramento has to offer this weekend. Uh, me too. Yeah. I'm very excited. And and in addition to all the muddy fun, there's more fun because there's a theme this year. I would love to introduce you to Brian right on over here. He is our Marvel man. He happens to be dressed up like Captain America for a reason. And why is that? Because uh, we're really excited to be using the Marvel characters for an overlay for the Tough Mudder this weekend. Marvel characters love to inspire people to be their best. And so mm -hmm. we're going to have a lot of Marvel giveaways, Marvel-themed challenges, and really bring all that Marvel action to Tough Mudder. Okay, and, mm -hmm. so, and people, too, when they participate in these events, they like to get involved in the theme. They like to dress up into costume and do things. So do you think we're going to be seeing a lot of... Captain America, some Black Widows, some Iron Men out there. Let's hope so. We're going yeah. to be giving away some shirts. We're encouraging everyone to dress up, show their Marvel love, and just really get people ex excited and inspired. Yeah, well, and I mean, there's a lot of Marvel love out there right now, too, with the, you know, Marvel's Infinity War mm -hmm. being released and just so much excitement. And I think we are inspired to go out and participate in fun things like this when you have actual superheroes that are going to be present and be a part of the event. So. Very awesome. Now, I want to talk about the athleticism behind this, though, because, um, Eric, you had mentioned, you know, you have the 5K, you have the half, you have the mm -hmm. full mutter. A, a lot of the time, people, need, they need to plan ahead for something like that to sure. make sure that they're physically ready. Yeah. You don't want people hurting themselves. Um, perhaps, though, if someone's inspired and they want to do this, um, they can actually come out and watch this tomorrow in anticipation of maybe participating next year, right? Exactly. Yeah, I mean, you don't need to jump in with both feet, although yeah. we, we encourage you. I mean, no matter your, your fitness level, you can really kind of just step into that zone and challenge yourself. I, I always tell this to people, I mean, that are, that are on the fence about doing it. You know, it, you're never doing it alone. It's all about teamwork and camaraderie. And it's, it's all about kind of keeping with that, that whole element of fun. And so it's, when you come out to a Tough Hunter event, it's really more about you with this new group of like 3,000 plus friends that are going to be there to help you and move you along. I know that the endurance aspect is something that people are super scared about, but it's uh, it, Certainly not, not a concern. Okay, great. And, and I love the footage that we just showed of somebody sliding on their stomach. I'm like, I, I want to do that. It happened. It's that. And it's probably going to happen this weekend. I, I mean, guarantee This course it. is muddy. I, I ran it yesterday, so yeah. Oh, did you? Yeah. Not, not shocking by looking at this guy, right? Like, I, just, I ran it yesterday. It was, mm -hmm. it was nothing. I, it's like product um, testing. I got to do it. <laughs> that's you know? right. I make sure it's good. Yeah. Uh, but we want to make sure that all you are inspired. And if you mm -hmm. are doing this tomorrow, or perhaps you want to take the right, uh, right foot forward to get you ready to participate in something like this, join us right now because we're going to be doing some workouts. We have our... Our ABC 10 Sag and Co athletes. Yes. And I'm gonna let which, uh, I'm, which I'm really excited about, uh, just because we're we're pulling them out of their normal jobs and giving them another job right now. So give them some yes. love out here. All right. So a couple different things about the Tough Mudder uh, training, right? This is kind of what I encourage people about. It's it's three parts, right? We have uh, some power. We're gonna go over some endurance, and we have some strength elements. You know, all three things that you should be keeping in mind when you're training for Tough Mudder. 
So what we brought in right here is the sandbag. The sandbag is kind of a ubiquitous thing you'll see in, in uh, uh, a lot of our Tough Mudder X uh, events. This is a uh, weighted implement. It can go from 20 to 100 pounds even. And what we're gonna do is some cleans with it. So from the bottom, we're gonna stand all the way up. So generating powerful hips. Oh, yeah, so I know, surprised. which is awesome. I'm super stoked. Well, you're, you're so skilled. I didn't anticipate this. Well, like, out of nowhere, bam. Amazing you know talent on this show, just by the way. <laughs> okay? So uh, the power really comes in through that hip right there using that weighted element. This is the ticket. Give me like five more. Come on. Let's go. Down the floor <laughs> and back up to the top. So powerful hip extension. This is what's going to help get you over those uh, obstacles that you saw on the okay. uh, on the package of like I'm the Everest it. and that type of thing. So, okay, I'm inspired. There we go. Last one. Drop Great in. Job. Tag your friend in because your friend's gonna be rocking it in some burpees next. Here we Woo! go. Look at so that. check Throw it out. Down. Oh no, we got we gotta get the hand tag. Okay, you hand got, tag. It's okay. all about teamwork and camaraderie, right. mutters. You That's know right. what I'm talking about. So endurance, right? Cardiovascular endurance is absolutely necessary whether you're tackling the Tough Mudder 5K or the Tough Mudder Full. So get your face on the floor and do some burpees. Come on, let's go. Okay, he's got one floor. minute. He's got 30 seconds to do this, and you got to pass it on to get to the 30 next one. Seconds? 30, 30 seconds? 30 seconds. How many, how many burpees is he going to get? He's on three. Let's go. Go. Let's go. 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 He was like, go. on the go. break, on the go. break too, we were, he was like, I want to do more. There we go. Make sure you Keep get that go. chest all the Keep way down, the, and then uh, fight it up. Jump it up. My stomach's burning that. watching you. It's awesome. burning. All right, everyone. Make sure that you head out to the Tough uh, Mudder and uh, enjoy this amazing event. And think ahead for Tag next off. year if you're not already a part of it. But if you do want to do it, you can sign up. Go. We got to get to her. Go, go, go. go. And then we got the step go. up. We're going to go that strength box. right get here. On that box. Lower body strength. And this is uh, absolutely something you should be training on. Tough Mudder has something for everybody. It certainly does. And where? what's the website? Real fast. Toughmudder.com. You can find all the latest up-to-date uh, event information, including the event happening at Gibson Ranch this weekend. So all right. see you guys there. Bye, everybody. Have a great weekend. We'll Yee! see you back here on Monday right here on Sack and Go. You're awesome! The following interview involves commercial content. The products and services featured appear as paid advertising.